Hey guys, this is George Adventurer here. Uh, just want to do a little review, quick review on the uh, Benchmade bug out. Uh, I know there's a lot of reviews out there on YouTube. I bought this thing back in early February at a gun show and uh, I've been wanting one. I've been looking at them uh, from day one when they came out. Uh, saw them at a few knife places and all. Never really picked one up or anything. I've heard, you know, I've seen good reviews, bad reviews on them. More good than bad, but... Um, so, they had these, these blue handle ones marked down 15 bucks. And they had the, the OD handle uh, marked down. So, I went ahead and got the blue and the blue was the original color I believe was the original color they came out with one reason I do like it I like the blue color uh, because I like blue and plus if I drop it in the leaves or the pine straw I can find it so uh, I went with the blue I like the blue I'm not gonna apologize for liking the blue yeah people might say well that's a girly color well I guess I like girly colors so I bought it, and to be honest with you, this is probably my favorite folder of all time. Now I've got another bit bench made. It's a Griptilian. Uh, I've got a I've got a uh, uh, Spider Co, which I do like. I do like those two also. But this one, there's, a, there's several things about this one I like. One of them is the light weight uh, handle material. This thing is light, and and I enjoy carrying it in my pocket. Now I don't use it, you know, I don't use it for real heavy stuff. But I, I actually clean my turkey with it this year. I killed a turkey second weekend of the season, and I use this knife to clean it, to prepare it. So the steel, I like the steel. I've heard different things about the steel. Uh, it's not an assisted opening, but it opens real smooth. It. Uh, you know, it's a nice, nice, smooth opening knife. One of the second thing I, I really like about it is the blade shape. You know, I do like the blade shape and it's stainless steel and I'm a big carbon steel. I'm a big carbon steel fan, but I like the stainless steel because uh, when I'm kayaking, if I'm kayaking in salt water or at the beach or whatever, you know, or just, just water in general, it'll, it'll hold up. Uh, but I do like the blade, the way it's shaped. I like, I like the little blue thumb stud on it. Uh, it's very smooth. You know, it it, it closes easy, uh, easy to open. I don't need a switch blade for what I do with a knife. You know, it's a tool. I carry it. Yeah, I can use it for self defense if needed, but it's a tool. Um, I like the, I like the, the pocket clip on it. I really like that. It, it it's about all you need i carry it in my shorts i carry it in my turkey hunting clothes or just my work pants whatever this this thing is with me every day uh it's a very sharp sharp knife um i'm sorry i keep looking over there i keep hearing something in the house but um but anyways uh you know i like the i like the i like the knife all around you know you hear people talking about the you know how the, the plastic could give a little bit yeah i mean i'm squeezing as hard as i can it gives a little bit but you know big deal it's a lightweight material plastic type material it's lightweight but it's got the bench made quality you know i like bench made folders uh and this is my favorite folder i, I really enjoy carrying it uh you know, really don't have any complaints about it. Um, you know, honestly, um, I put this leather lanyard on it, kind of finish it up, but it's in my pocket every day. I carry it to work with me. If I'm out in the woods, if I'm hunting, I went turkey hunting yesterday and I had it in my pocket. You know, of course I usually have a couple knives. I had my Azula on my belt, and uh, which is my all time favorite knife. And I'll probably do a review on it. But as far as a folder, this bench made is is my number one i don't regret buying it i paid a, a hundred 
for it. Uh, it was marked down from 115. I think it was money well spent. A lot of people, a lot of people, you know, think, well, why, why would you spend that much on that? Well, because I don't lose knives, and I will probably have this one till, till they put me in the grave, and I'm going to use it, and I use them hard, so I'll see. I'll do a follow-up video maybe in a couple years and let you know about it, but I recommend it, man. You know, I recommend, you know, you may not like the blue, but they got some different handle colors now. They've also got the smaller size in these. They got an orange handle, I know. I forgot what they're called. They got a name for them. Uh, but uh, it's, a, it's a little bit smaller than this one. And I'm not gonna give you all the dimensions and everything on it. You can see, you can see the size of it. You can see the size of it in my hand. Uh, but it's, it's a, it's a, it's a nice knife, man. It's a, uh, you know, it's a, it's a, it's just a cool knife. You can see it there. It's a, uh, it's a nice knife. Uh, I recommend it. Wouldn't think twice about buying another one. I do like the, I do like the green handle one, the OD one. But uh, there's just something about this blue, man. I just like it. So, and I don't really have to worry about trying to find it if I drop it in the leaves but anyways I just hope y'all have a great day and hope God blesses you today as he as he has me and hope you have a, a great week get out in the woods man get out get outside and take care <laughs>